Hey guys, I'm Art, and today I'm gonna to show you what's the very last thing I do in all of my drawings. And don't worry, I'm not gonna say save it or close it, because that would just be messed up. So what is the last thing I do? Let me show you. Once you finish your drawing and are happy with it and ready to just consider it finished and done, I go down here to the very bottom, I create a new layer, and then I'm gonna fill that layer with a dark gray. What we're gonna be doing is adding a grain to this. I always pick this dark gray that's seen here. Feel free to pick any gray you want, but as for me, I pick this dark gray. And then I just fill the layer, so hit G, which brings up the paint bucket, and fill it. And then now we're gonna apply the grain or the noise. Go up here to filter, go to noise, hit add noise. And these are the settings that I use to add the grain. The amount, 25%, Gaussian is selected, and monochromatic is also selected. Hit OK. Now we're gonna to wanna to add a little blur to it so that the grain isn't too harsh. So you go up to filter, hit blur, and then select blur. And now that's done, you then go to your blending mode, which is at normal right now, and select soft light. You see instantly it, it did have an effect on the drawing, but right now it's a little bit too much. Typically I change the opacity from 30 to 40, depending on what the drawing is. So let's start off with 40. Now let's zoom in to see the difference. So here, let's take it off. This is what it was before. And this is what it looks like after. Though it's subtle, you do notice there is a change, particularly in going from light to dark. You see the grain is now in the areas that have color. And the purpose of this grain is it does help blending the colors, it does add grit, it does add a sense of texture because when you take it off, some areas appear very flat. It also depends on how you paint, but it does add a sense of more realism and does help with the whole adding a sense of grit and texture. Cause you see right here in this location, you take it off. It looks very paintery adding this grain. It's not a major change, it's subtle, but it does have its importance. And like I said, adding a little bit of grit, a little texture, helping the colors blend in, especially if you have gradients. And it just overall, I just like how the appearance of the drawings look after once this is applied. And if you're starting to learn how to add textures to your drawing, this is the easy way to add it to help the areas that don't have much texture or much grit is a simple film grain at the end helps any drawing out. This is what I do at the very end, followed by saving it and then closing it. Hopefully this tip helped you out. If you like this video, why don't you give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, why don't you consider hitting that subscribe button and ringing that bell so you never miss any new video that I do. And until the next one guys, goodbye.